Ever wondered why so many Hollywood directors are drawn to India? Is it for the spices, the vibrant colors or the bustling streets? No, it's for our serene and beautiful architectural marvels. Hi, I am Sagar and today we are going to talk about six stunning locations that made to the big screen. Hollywood baby. Let's start with the Christopher Nolan's classic, The Dark Knight Rises. I'm Batman. Remember this scene where Christian Bale, aka Bruce Wayne, escapes a pit? It is none other than Mehrangad Fort. Built in 1459, it stands on a hill about 400 feet above the city, with walls that are up to 118 feet high and 69 feet thick, designed to protect against any invasion. Its sandstone walls, intricate carvings and huge courtyard showcases Rajputana pride, which leads the scene a powerful, almost a mythical feel. No wonder why Nolan chose this fort for Batman's escape. Next one on the list, another Nolan's classic. Who doesn't like Nolan movies? It is Tenet. Aage se padho ya piche se, dono same hai. Kya baat hai sir? Kya baat hai sir? Okay, if you remember this scene where John David Washington or the protagonist meet Dimple Kapadia on a building terrace and if you look closely, that scene and the chase was shot in Mumbai. Upon my research, I found it was filmed at Neelam Shri Vardhan Tower Apartments. It's a beautiful art deco building set in a city with rich history. Though it's not an iconic location, but it makes a dynamic backdrop for Tenet's high-speed chase scene. From one classic to another, let's talk about franchise movies and we enter the world of Bond. James Bond. It is still going on and let me know who was your favorite James Bond. I have added mine in the comments, you can add yours. But chalo, let me take you to the 80s James Bond ska era, the 1983 classic Octopussy. Udaipur, the city of lakes became an elegant playground of James Bond in Octopussy. First location was the Taj Lake Palace, set against the tranquil waters of Lake Pichola. This palace is an actual palace stone hotel that seems to float on water. Constructed between 1743 and 1746 by Maharaja Jagat Singh II, with intricate white marbles and octagonal domes, it's a pure Rajasthani elegance. The palace features white marble walls, octagonal towers and carved jharokas, a hallmark of Mughal-inspired Rajasthani design. Bond also visits Shiv Nivas Palace, built in early 20th century by Maharaja Fateh Singh, which offers an airy, open layout with grand courtyards and marble arches. Together, they bring a royal charm, perfect for Bond's world of mystery and sophistication. Another movie set in Rajasthan, the best exotic marigold hotel. Film at Ravla Khempur, a historic village hotel near Udaipur. This 17th century Haveli's vintage architecture with its inner courtyard, traditional arches and original decor helped to portray the protagonist's journey of self-discovery in a foreign yet comforting environment, bringing both elegance and authenticity to the film's narrative of adventure and personal growth in India. Moving on from one romantic story to another, in Eat, Pray, Love, Julia Roberts' journey of self-discovery led her to India, where she found solace at the Harimandir's ashram in Pataudi near Delhi. Surrounded by nature, its minimalist architecture include basic stone and brick structure and quiet meditation halls. This peaceful setting is ideal for the film's introspective journey, capturing the tranquility of Indian spiritual architecture. The final movie is Million Dollar Arm. Who could forget this iconic movie? If you have not seen this movie, I would recommend highly to watch it after this video. The film is based on a true story which focuses on two baseball players on an epic journey. One short clip shows Taj Mahal in the backdrop. This monument needs no introduction. It's one of the seven wonders of the world built in 17th century by Emperor Shah Jahan. Embodies Mughal architecture grandeur with a symmetrical garden, reflecting ponds and stunning white marble structure. It remains one of the most iconic backdrops of the film. There are more such films that are shot in India like Chris Hemsworth's Extraction, Jobs 
and Dev Patel's lion. But in this video, we have covered most of it. From forts to palaces to ashrams and Taj Mahal. Indian architecture has captured Hollywood's imagination, bringing recognition to our country's rich culture and architectural heritage. That's it for today, but let us know in the comments which is your favorite Hollywood movie scene that is set in India. And one more thing, do not forget to like and share this video and subscribe to our channel for more such architectural explorations. Bye.